What's good, y'all? It's Chucky and Paulie P, 1921 Print Shop. Man, today we're gonna be doing embroidery. We're really not supposed to be doing anything at all because the city is on lockdown because it's a tropical storm that was supposed to hit Houston. But the storm made a turn for the best. <laughs> not the worst, you know what I'm saying? So we decided to go ahead and get out and get some orders done, you know, even though the city is still on lockdown because we are supposed to be having a flood if you live in houston and you know how them floods be but good thing the storm made a turn so like i said we're gonna be getting to it today it's doing uh some embroidery so y'all stay tuned all right guys so in this video we're gonna show you step by step on how we embroider hats right now we are attaching the hat into our hat hoop and then we're gonna attach the whole hat hoop into our embroider machine and for this order our customer purchased 10 um, trucker hats to be embroidered on the back of the hats we do clip any excess uh, fabric or loose fabric just to make sure the hat's nice and secured our machine is going to scan the hat and then it's going to start embroidering so when you do place an order at any business you first have to get your logo digitized so that was the first step um, I did not add it to this video but you do digitize the logo so this person did order 10 hats and we are using an 8 head embroidery machine so we do 5 hats first as you can see here and then the second batch will do another 5 hats This year, it seems like trucker hats has been trending. A lot of our customers has been ordering trucker hats, especially the one with the foam top. Just like this one, as you can see the top, the white part is foam. So a lot of people have been ordering trucker hats and dad hats lately. Our standard measurements when it comes to hats, either dad hats or trucker hats, um, any hats except beanies is 2.5, your logo has to be within 2.5 inches in height or 5 inches in width. As you can see on the left and the right side of the video, there's already hats attached to the hat hoop. So it's good to have multiple hat hoops if you have, you know, like a forehead or a head machine. So you can um, already attach it to the hat hoop. And then once this is done embroidering, you can just switch them out. So it's just a faster process. So on the screen you can see where the needle is embroidering and also how many stitch count is in this logo. As you can see it has 9,464 stitches and we were at 7,000 stitches. Now this is the finished outcome. All you have to do now is clean it and remove the stabilizer. Alright guys, so we just finished some embroidery orders. We are about to take a break, get something to eat and then get back to it. We actually ran out of uh, magenta ink for our Epson DTG printer so we'd rather go pick that up we do order our locally here in Houston at a place called Grimco so if you're in Houston and need a place to buy ink that's where we yeah, buy ours we got all of hers. Yeah, a hole in the bag or some on the floor and shit I'm like I'm gonna count 26 we just did some we just did they say the same time. 
How about you just say? We just did some screen print uh, straps. <laughs> what is this like a waistband? Yeah. Yeah, so one of our customers owns a fitness line, so he, she wanted her logo screen printed on these waistband. Turned out pretty good. So yeah, we're about to go get something to eat. Oh, so we're back at the shop. We have two tours today, so this space we do run out. Anybody want to do pop-up shops, birthday events, whatever. We just got some new lights installed in this <laughs> studio. And we are trying to figure out where exactly did they put the switch. <laughs> you got Kevin right here. Say what up. <laughs> oh, you want to do a fit check? Oh, so what's up, what's up? Um, you know, man, it's ending it's Monday, so you already know that I'm going to black cement threes. Okay. Take off your head. Take off your head. Take off your head. <laughs> <laughs> That's right, shark in the back. <laughs> Make sure you like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. We'll see you on our next video.